welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be doing a super late May favorites with you. And I know it's like halfway through June, but Dan and I've just got back off holiday and I've been quite absent on my channel for quite a few months now. I've been quite flaky with my filming, but I wanted to do my May favorites because I did have some stuff I really liked that I wanted to share with you and I didn't wanna miss out on monthly favorites either. Before you know it, I know it's gonna be my June favorites and stuff, but I wanted to do this video, so let's get started. So starting with makeup, I have been loving my MUA Dusk Till Dawn palette. Now in this one, I actually took this on holiday as well, but I've really been loving the gold one here and then kind of like this champagne-y kind of color above it as well. I think it's lovely when you're on holiday and you've kind of got that, um, you're getting a bit more tanned and I just think it's a really nice sort of combo to use together. Um, Obviously I was using it before my holiday as well, but it's a really nice palette. They're only like four pounds, I think, from Superdrug. And yeah, so I've really been loving this. My other makeup favorite is a Revlon Lip Butter in Cupcake. Now, my Revlon Lip Butters get in a complete and utter mess and kind of lose all their shape. They go a bit manky. But I think this is a really, really beautiful pale pink. Um, I layer it over the top sometimes um, of a different sort of pinky lipstick to give it a really nice kind of glossy shine to it. But um, otherwise it's really nice if you're going for a bit more of a subtle look and you just want to pop a little bit of colour on. This is a really nice sort of summery spring pink and I just really like it. For nail polishes this month I've got a few and one of them you will have seen, I've spoken about it on my channel a lot of times. But um, I've been loving the China Glaze um, Flip Flop Fantasy to put on my toenails. I wanted to wear this on holiday and I did. I just think it looks really, really lovely with a tan. Um, it is very neon. It's actually one you don't have to put like a white coat underneath it and I still feel that you get like a good enough real bright neon pop. But this is something I will always wear on my feet. Obviously Flip Flop Fantasy is what it's called and it works the best on your feet so I love this one. One of the other ones that I've really been loving has been Essie's Bikini Sotini. I think this is just a really beautiful blue. I know it's been spoken about on YouTube loads but um, I really like it and something that I didn't hear a lot of people talk about on YouTube is that actually it has got like a bit of a glittery sort of fleck in it. Um, which just adds a real nice shine to the nail. So yeah, I really have been loving this one this month. And the last one um, has been one of the Barry M um, nail paint jellies, and this one has been in Sugar Apple, and this was the last one of the three that came out of the collection, and I finally got my hands on it, and oh my God, I love it. It's been one I've been taking off and reapplying, and I've really just been sort of flitting between these two, mainly throughout the month of May. And now that we've got into June, I'm trying to get back into the real bright colours. Um, so that's been my nail polishes that I have been loving throughout May. For a perfume that I've sort of rediscovered, I've actually nearly finished this, is the Victoria's Secret um, Hello Darling one. And as you can see, there's hardly anything left in it. I think it's just a really, it's kind of like a vanilla-y, um, very, very sweet. It's a really nice perfume, I love it. And yeah, I've nearly used it up, really, so that's a bit of a shame, because I'll have to take a little trip to Victoria's Secret. For body items, um, I've only actually got one at the moment, and it's the Cherry and Macadamia Body Butter. As you can see, I've pretty much finished it. I love it. It literally smells like a Bakewell tart. I just think it's so nice. It feels so nice on the skin. Um, and yeah, since I've come back off holiday, I've been peeling really quite badly. My skin just dries out so quick, even though I use so much after sun. I've had to go straight back to using a body butter because after sun's just not strong enough. Um, and I need a real deep moisturiser. So I am nearly out of that one. I have just been shopping this morning. So I have gone and bought a different body butter, which might end up on this channel. I'm sure I will review it at some point. But um, yes, yeah, so I have been loving that. <laughs> Random favourite time, and I have been obsessed with Vionetta, and it's the mint one. Oh, I can smell the mint coming out of the box. This is like a serious dessert from like the 80s, 90s time, maybe even 70s, I don't even know when they were invented. But um, I love it, I absolutely love the white creamy bit, I think it's so yummy, and yeah, so that's been my random favourite for May. <laughs> For my YouTube favourite, it's been Shannon Sullivan, and I think she's a brilliant YouTuber. I will have her channel linked down below. She uses so much like natural, organic, cruelty-free products, products that don't have like parabens in, 
and it's taken me so long to find another YouTuber who likes to use products that doesn't have loads of chemicals in and she's opened me up to so many more brands that I'm definitely going to be investigating and she just seems really really sweet and I really like her channel so I, like I said I'll have that link down below for you guys so that's pretty much it for this month's monthly favourites. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I know it's really late and I'm sorry, but we haven't got anything else planned now for a few weeks, well, a few months. So hopefully I'll go back to regular filming every single weekend for you. And yeah, so make sure you're subscribed, thumbs up if you like this video. And let me know some comments down below, some videos that you would like me to do, because that'd just be really interesting to make sure I'm always making videos you like. So I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you guys are enjoying the nice weather. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. The last thing, oh, come on. Bugs in the summer. The last 